She's gone looking for a long trip. She wanted to like, hit the restroom. Ease up on her, Michaela. You're squeezing too tight with your legs. See that knob right there in front of you? Turn it to the left. It'll shut it off. <laughs> too much lemonade for lunch. Lemonade. That'll do it every time. <laughs> All right there, boys. Reverse, you got a reverse button? I think Tate's horse is gonna be crazy. <laughs> Your horse is independent. Uh-oh. It's bucking. Be, get comfortable. Rub, rub your horse. Make sure he knows you. His Come saddle's on. leaning a little to the right. Do you see that? No. Did that matter? I don't know. He stands up and jerk it. Hello? Stand up and jerk it. We are going to watch Tate McKinley take off the horses. Do you want to come? Stand up and just jerk. Okay, come on. Now jerk to the Bring right. Bring JJ. There you go. <laughs> ah, there you go. All right, bye. <laughs> Stand up, sit down. Bye, bye, bye. Nobody's been a cheerleader. Oh, no. He's <laughs> heard those annoying chairs over and over again. <laughs> Whoa. We were the, I wasn't counting, were you? So is this a family with you? The owners are, yes, mm -hmm. yes, they are in the uh, license, in the work, in the brand here. Wow. The mothers will stand behind you because you've been coming. Okay, guys, let's go up for this moment. We've got a little safety net for you. Don't die on the trail. <laughs> <laughs> Did you sign the waiver? <laughs> Twice. This is Diane Canyon, and we hope you have an enjoyable stay. There are a few things you need to know before you leave on today's horse and mule ride. First, never get on or off your horse or mule at any time unless the guide is by your side to help you. Second, if you are wearing a hat, do not let your hat fall or blow off. That will startle almost every horse or mule. If you have any doubt as to the security of your hat, please leave it behind and pick it up after the ride is completed. Third, never remove a jacket, shirt, or other clothing article unless the guide is notified and can take hold of your horse or mule while this is being done. Fourth, sit up straight in the saddle with your toes up and heels down. Do not let your horse or mule eat along the trail or lag behind. The ideal distance between each horse and mule is four to six feet or just a little over a meter. If your horse or mule does lag behind, they have a tendency to run fast to catch up and then every horse behind yours will do the same. Fifth, if you'd like to take a photo, we'll be happy to stop at any time along the way. But we do suggest the best time to take a photo is when your guide stops to point out each viewpoint. Finally, we line the horses out of the corral in the order they get along the back. So please keep them in that order and do not pass other horses. If you enjoy your ride today, tip your guide. They work hard for you.
Remember, everyone is here to have a safe and fun time, and your safety is our number one concern. If you have any questions, be sure to ask your guide. Hey guys, any questions? Alright, if you need something later out on the ride, uh, the guide's name is Bo, give him a holler and he'll be glad to help you out. Okay, okay he's still side base. Bring up uh, Queenie Chili Pepper. Send them others, I'll give you a call. Okay.